In this video, we're going to look at how easy it is to update a pivot table. Now the key here to make it easy is to have your pivot table based upon an Excel table. Now once again, if your pivot table or pivot tables are based upon an Excel table, it makes it very easy to update the pivot tables. I want to go back to our most recent videos where we did a pivot table that was showing a frequency distribution based upon age. We had our ages here, our chart. We had a hundred people that took part in a survey. Now we have our pivot table, the name of that pivot table is called age, but it was based originally upon an Excel table. We're going to click on this sheet called survey results. We had that Excel table that we created at the beginning of this exercise and initially it had a hundred respondents. But since that time we took another survey where it's no longer 100 respondents, it's all the way up to 200 respondents. So we've updated that initial Excel table. It has now 200 respondents. If we click on our frequency distribution by age, it's only showing 100. Well, how do we update that? Once again, this pivot table is based upon that Excel table. All we have to do is click within our pivot table, click on the Analyze tab. After clicking on that Analyze tab, all we have to do is move over to Refresh click the down arrow, click on refresh all, and our pivot table has been changed to reflect the new data coming in from our original Excel table. It's now showing 200 people, the numbers have changed, and our chart has changed. Now once again the whole key here is that our pivot tables were based upon an Excel table and Excel tables like pivot tables are dynamic. They can change. Thank you.